door frame, a window frame. All right, that's what I wanted. We'll put that over here so I can spy on the uh, the NPC that spawns over here. And then we'll put in a door. Excellent. Okay. And now we'll place our window to finish that up. The controls are very simple, like to craft and stuff. It's just, I, I'm not used to it yet. I don't like the shine on that wood. That's weird. It's like I put Verithane all over my freaking walls. Right on. Can I open a window? Yeah, I can. Look at that. Is that cool? That's awesome. All right. So I should probably, uh, now that cleaned up quite a bit of the task tracker there, which is good. So we'll just keep following it for a little bit here. We'll make a wooden box. I need two string or rope. And then uh, that'll be done. And then we'll have a little bit of storage too. I should probably build some more walls there too. The storage down here. And we'll put it beside the, uh, the bench. There we go. Nice. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to need that crude oil for a while. So I'll put that in there. Uh, the rotten food can go in there. These guys can go in there. Rotten vegetables. Sure. Stone axe. I got a spare. I'll probably just throw it away. Uh, and that there too. Just stuff I know I'm not going to be using. All right. What's next on the list? Uh, collect the animal hides okay so we have our knife and we have our bow and there's a lot of rabbits around so we'll go get another rabbit there were a lot of rabbits around there we go i see him now oh nice shot okay there we go hides is complete and we're at level nine. Let's go ahead and hit our tech tree here and see if we can unlock anything. So we can do chemist bench now. Uh, I could have done that at level eight, I think. And a uh, quiver. Excellent. Okay. I don't know. What, how does that help? Increases ammunition, changes speed, change speed by 20%. So I can change ammunition. That's really cool. All right. And what do we have? Flintlock pistol already. I can make a pistol already. Yeah, I've got some of this stuff here. I think I have everything I need, but it's one shot, right? It's flintlock. it will take forever to reload. That's cool though. All right, structures we can unlock. I wish there was a point system. Like you get so many skill points per level and then you've, you've got to work your way through things here, but there isn't. There is a, quite a bit of stuff here available. Fish basket, I can fish. That's cool vehicles not till 16 small pouch so that'll increase inventory size i can make that right now uh supplies we can make grilled fish on the fire which is cool so fish basket and grilled fish i think i had taken care of my food issues if i have any and then our tech we're still nope we can make a simple jammer all right okay this device uses ether shards to block signals from creature controllers and liberate them and allow you to recruit them as followers okay so that must be the uh the neck brace that the uh, npcs are wearing so i'm going to go ahead and make one of those and i'm going to try it on the next npc that spawns on the ocean there and uh and see if we can recruit him or her this is pretty cool uh jammer it does take a lot of crystal i have four available I seem to get chris i need iron ingots i'm not sure if i have any i seem to be able to uh what am I thinking here? So if I get some stone, I can try to gamble for some iron ingots out of it. I do have iron organic salt, lead, iron ore I have. So we'll go ahead and put that in here. I'm gonna activate it. And we'll, can I make iron? I don't even have it pop up here. Oh yeah, I do. Okay, so I need two pieces. All right, we'll get out of here. Let's go collect some stone. Wooden shoes, didn't I make those? I thought I made them. What happened there? So I've only got another level before I lose my respawn. So if I die after level 10 or level 10 and above, I'm going to end up having to run back to my body. So berries will do it. I want to start eating fish though, I think. I think fish is going to be the way to go. Let's just get some stone into the furnace there and see if we can uh, get some iron out of it. Oh, that's a pretty shiny rock up there. I bet that's iron. Oh, that's a lead.
Let's get a little more stone here and then we'll uh I'll see if I can get some iron out of it. I'm not sure where to find iron yet in this game, but I can gamble with stone. What is that up there? That looks almost like a cave. I don't think it is. It's too small for that. Little uh hidey hole. Oh, and let's try to repair that. Really cool that I can repair. And that gave me a level. Excellent. So that's it. This is uh, where, where I die is where my body's left. And I'll respawn probably at my um, sleeping bag, I guess. Little den of some sort. Actually, I should get a little more uh, lumber here for the furnace. I'd like to see what the other biomes look like. You know, the desert one's probably pretty standard. Uh, the Well, I guess same with the winter one too, but... This one's a very bright biome. Like, it's very bright here. And there's palm trees. No coconuts, though. That's hilarious. I have unlimited weight capacity. Make some more uh, wooden walls and maybe finish this up. I'm not sure if I can put a roof on there yet, but... Of course that NPC hasn't come back yet. Maybe there was two to begin with, and once you killed them both, uh, that was it. That's too bad. Oh no, there we go. There's a fellow right down there. Axe Bandit. Doesn't sound friendly. Cool. Getting a little shelter here. That looks kind of neat. And I should have one more coming here. Just gonna have a look at my tech tree real quick to see if I can um, upgrade anything here. I'm not sure if I did it at level 10. Uh, wood hammer. Okay, this is user repair structures. Structures with more than 95% durability or that of being attacked cannot be repaired. Okay, so we'll go ahead and learn that. Stick grenade, that's hilarious. Okay. Space time beacon. Emits a signal to receive supplies. Place materials inside to maintain nearby structure. Features adjustable PvP protection time. Upgrade to expand range. I'm not really, no idea what any of that means. But we'll go ahead and learn it. Or unlock it. And what else do we have here? Flip floor. Oh, traps. Simple jammer. I gotta make one of those for this NPC here. And we gotta test it out. Okay, so now we can make traps. Alright. Let's make under our tech tree and we'll make a simple jammer so we need two iron and two tape and we'll see if we can get some iron ore from the rock we'll just do a mac oh 93 holy cow let's see what happens here i think it does all 93 at once no one at a time wonder if i'm getting xp for it and there's two iron ore so that'll make one bar we'll just have to wait for that number to grow a little bit here kind of cool that you get random material or nothing from the stone so it's a it's a total lottery it's a total gamble there's another iron ore i'm just going to cancel that and we will go ahead and make a couple iron bars and once that's done, I think we have what we need to make that jammer. I don't know how long, like, if the jammer's permanent or not, or how long it lasts. Hopefully long enough to get an NPC to follow me around. I guess it's a slave, like, because they have those colors on them. Like, do you liberate them? How does that work? <laughs> it's kind of uh, interesting to find out what it's all about, how it works. I wonder if it is like Conan Exiles. Yeah, we are gonna build the tech item, which is... So yeah, we have everything we need for this. So we'll go ahead and craft that. This is so weird. I should probably have more than one, just to make sure, in case I screw up the first one, which is very, very possible. I do want to make a fish basket. Okay, so I can recruit them as followers, not slaves. I can liberate them and recruit them as followers. So. So we'll do that. We'll try it on this next NPC here. Hopefully I don't die. So I do want to make one of these real quick. So I need eight rope. Curious on how that works. At least I'll have some food available. I do have the berries too, but and the meat. Not exactly sure how that fish basket works, but I'm going to go try to use it before I uh, take out this NPC. Well, I guess I'll just wait till it 
turns. I think I have to be in the water. Well, that's no good. That's a burly looking axe murderer there. Okay, let's, uh, how do I do this? All right, we're going to try to rescue this guy, liberate this guy. Hopefully he doesn't kill me. I just have to have my spear ready. Should I follow him in there and try this? Whoa, where are you? Um, I didn't do anything. Oh, you know what? Oh, he's got a wicked axe. Look at that axe and his armor too. He's got like regular clothes. Oh, you see the, the thing that shows up above his head? The the cuff thing um, and the chain, the ball and chain type thing. I wonder if that's got something to do with uh, when you're supposed to use the, the jammer on him. Like, I think I can use it on him right now. Cause yeah, where's my loot? Okay, so I gotta make another jammer. Yeah, and I don't wanna kill him. I think I gotta wait for that icon and then I can use it on him. Okay. Yeah, this might take a minute unfortunately so wait for four iron ore i'm just gonna sit here and wait honestly oh does it stop when i walk away i think it stopped like crafting i think i have to have the window open well, that sucks all right let's have a look here see if it reset and it did okay so clearly there's a bug there i walked away from it while it was processing something and then no longer existed for some reason but i think i have to stand here uh, so I might have to speed this up. I'm getting really close to the two hour mark now. I'm just a couple of minutes away. And honestly, you know, I haven't gotten really far into the game. Two hours is definitely not enough time to uh, figure the game out. And uh, but looking at your tech tree, it's just massive. There's so much to learn here. Like, look at all the weapons. Like, look at that level 59 structures. Like there's so much vehicles. There's a freaking tanks. Yeah, it's a pretty big game, so I think I'm going to hang on to it. The two iron bars here should give me what I need. So I can't close this window, so just by doing something else in there, kind of reset it, I think. Let's make another jammer here. Let's see if we can get this guy. I see him running around there. Dude, I'm trying to free you. There we go. Where's your kick-ass axe? Oh, he dodged it. Are you freaking kidding me? And he killed me on top of it. Dang it. I can't believe that guy jumped out of the way. Man, I wasn't expecting that. At least now I know that's a possibility. I guess they can dodge. And they do so much damage. And I have armor on. Can you imagine if I didn't have armor on? I'd be dead so quick. I just got to get him down enough so that... There we go. Now we go and try this one more time. It's stressful. So I really want this to work. There we go. Nope. Didn't work. Did not work. I'm not going to kill him because I got to figure this out. I don't know how to, uh, I think I got, maybe I got to get him down more in health. I don't know. Yeah, I'm going to go online. I'm going to see if I can figure this out. So I uh, went online to check to see how to do it properly. And, and I think I'm doing it right. You got to wait for that icon. I, maybe I got to throw more than one jammer at them. But like that, once that icon pops, you can uh, you can go ahead and uh, throw that jammer at them. And they should submit. They should. I think they go down on one knee and, and you should be able to uh, recruit them. I guess I'll just have to make more than one. So if I assign an NPC to the crafting table, then maybe I can keep the uh, the queue going because it looks like there's a spot there for the NPC to be, uh, be assigned, I guess. So maybe we'll see what happens. I think I'm getting more plant mucus from the big plants. What do I have here? Only five. All of that for five.
There we go. I got 20. I should be able to make uh, plenty of tape now. As long as I didn't lose a home. This map is huge. Like, it's so massive. I can see how this would be fun multiplayer, especially PvP. All right. Okay, let's have a look here now. How many of these can we make? We can make eight. All right, I think that will be enough. And I think I'm limited by how many of these ether shards I have. Oh, 30 seconds a piece. I'm gonna have to cut this one for sure. Now we're going to get my bow ready. I don't have very many arrows left. And we're gonna go find the, uh, the guy. Okay, there he is there. I sure wish I knew how to put that fish uh, fish thingy. I think it's gotta be on my property here. I don't think I can just go place it in there. See if I can unlock any tech. I've gone up a couple levels without looking. Uh, weapon crafting table, that'll come in handy. Uh, we can make an iron ax. That's what that guy was running around with. Some more boosts, small thermal lining. I guess this is for my armor. Or there's a cold biome grinding table. Springboard, that's another trap. Uh, rain collector yeah we'll uh, we'll make one of those but right now we're focused on the jammers we have eight available I'm here to save you from I don't know what I don't know who's in control of you but it's not good right stop bouncing around am I cheesing it right now he barely took any damage he's not taking very much damage at all I wonder if I need to hit him in the head I'm gonna run out of arrows here Oh, that was a good shot. Okay, now that icon showed up, I'm going to give him another hit in case he heals a little bit and loses that icon. If I get a chance to, I'm not sure if I will. All right, I think we're going to do this. I don't know how far I can throw these. Oh, I got him. Oh, my God. What do I do? Uh... This is his inventory. Favorite food. Okay, let's give him let's give him that. Now what? Is he gonna eat it? So what are you doing? Are you His obedience is at four percent. His chaos is at twelve seventy seven. So I think that has to go down and his obedience has to go up. Uh his resonance is at ninety two. I'm not sure what that means, but so far it's going down. I think I got him. I think we're good. Yeah, I think he's just gonna eat his favorite food here and I don't think I have to use it I just have to put it in his inventory his fullness is at 194 his number just went up automatically so he's eating it I'm gonna need some more berries oh he's eating it so fast okay I'll wait for that to come down a bit before I but he is going up quick okay I need more food I need more berries. Pretty sure I get the berries from the bushes here. Just random. I don't want to lose that guy. There's some more berries there. Not very many though. Maybe I shouldn't feed him. Like I, I've got to feed him one at a time. I wish I knew how to split stacks. Can't believe I've only found one berry so far. Yeah, he went through that stack really fast. So what I need to do is feed him once and then pull it out of his inventory wait for his fullness to go down a little bit and feed him again i think that's how i have to do it i gotta get back there though i don't want to lose him i noticed when i held down uh my throw key that showed where it was gonna land and i think this time it just happened to land in the right spot so uh i'm talking about the jammer i think that's about the only reason why i got it on the first one where you at there you're at nine percent your chaos is still going down or it's kind of hovering now isn't it so we'll give you another one of these. Holy crap, you ate the whole thing. Uh, we'll give you some roasted meat. Yeah, I don't know. I'm going to have to uh, cook some more or get some more berries. Wow, I don't think I had enough resources on me to... Oh, look at that. I'm, I gave you all my food. And I'm, I'm going to die. That's what's happening here. I see. I see what's happening. I'm starving right now. This is not going to turn out well for me. I don't think so i just ate two in one shot there and it's helping with my food but my water's still low so i need some berries i like totally screwed myself over here i didn't think uh 
the survival part of this game was that big of a deal and and here i am starving out i have no liquid in me i need water and uh i have an npc just waiting to come home with me but i can't do anything because i'm gonna die i guess dying wouldn't be a bad thing either i don't know what happens to him if i die though i don't know if he's still gonna be there or not come on berries How am I not finding any berries? I had so many and now I can't find a single one. There we go. Okay, that should help with the water a little bit. Not for very long though. Try to get some more meat cooked for the uh, NPC. And I need more berries for myself. I'm sure there's a way to get water and I just... I. I totally screwed the pooch on that one. Man, I had more berries than I knew what to do with, and now I can't find any. Finally, one. I can't believe that. There's another one. Is he still down? I don't know if he is. No, he's walking around. Ah, oh, I gotta start over. Dang it. Okay, well. Oh, I can, he's still, uh, he's walking around, but he's not submissive anymore. Okay. So we'll get some more meat in here. And I can't walk away. That sucks. So I've got enough food, but not enough to maintain uh, him. I need um, I need more berries for. Well, what happens if I drink salt water? <laughs> let's just let's see if it's salty. Ah, uh, not a good idea. Oh yeah, it totally helped. You can't tell me that's fresh water. Oh my god, I've been running around trying to. Wow, never mind. So I need more berries. Actually, let's go back and see if I can uh, get them back down on the ground and we'll give them that meat and see if that helps. If the meat works, then I'll uh, I'll just go out and kill a bunch of rabbits. I should be able to stay on top of it. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? That's not him. Don't know where he is. Oh, is that him? Yeah, that's him. That's his name. Yeah, this could get dangerous. That is him. Got him. I gotta start all over though. Is that working? He likes roasted meat. 30 fullness. I don't see it going down though. Uh, his chaos is going down though. But his obedience isn't going up. At all. Not one bit. Still hasn't eaten the meat. I don't know if the meat works. Maybe only the, uh, the berries. If that's the case, then I may as well give up on that because I, I cannot get enough berries to sustain him. He just goes through them like so quick. I don't know where to get them. I don't know where to get that many. Yeah, I got to go find uh, a bunch of bushes. I don't think I'm going to be able to maintain him. I'm going to have to hit him again with the uh, jammer. But I think I know how to do it now. So I have to, like, I can't throw it at him. I have to throw it at his feet. And it's got to land just right. Then he uh, will submit. I don't think that meat helps. So the roasted meat, it didn't improve anything on him. Even though it was listed as a favorite food. But the berries work. So I need a lot of freaking berries. Like a lot. Yeah, I thought that was the ocean. I thought that was salt water. I didn't realize I can drink it. <laughs> That's great, though, knowing that it's easy to uh, quench my thirst and to eat, too. I can just kill some rabbits. and So I've got eating and thirst out of the way now, for sure. I don't have to worry about it so much. I'm going to have to knock that guy out again, I think, because I am definitely not getting very many berries here. I'm going to need probably about, I don't know, 50 or so. I think there's no weight limit in this game. 
He looked a little bit different that time. Uh, first time I saw him, he was wearing a toque, and this time he had like a, like some sort of an eye patch or something. Twenty-four. I can just about do vehicles. I'm one level away from vehicles. Probably uh, shouldn't be focusing on this NPC. I just, uh, I kind of got my head, mind stuck to it now and I kind of want to complete it. Okay, let's have a look here. Uh, we're at 32 berries. I'm, I can make rubber now and gunpowder, which is good. Yeah, what else can I unlock here? I have to make that table before I can go any further there. Gear crafting table. That's awesome. Look at that. You make a lot of stuff there. Make a medical table. Metal processor. Cool. I don't know how to do this. Talent book nine. I'm not sure what that means. So I'll start heading back. I, I'm just going to try it one more time and then that'll be it. That'll be it for the day or for this video, I think. I don't know if I give him those berries if he heals himself with them. I don't think he does. I think he has to stay uh, under a certain health. So I'm over there somewhere. I'll just collect all my way. I can't tell if these plants on the ground are respawning or not. Oh, I'm out of food here. Did I leave it all behind? Yeah, I gave it all to that guy who's not eating any of it. I don't want to eat my berries. I will eat a rabbit, though. Hello, little rabbit. I highly doubt he's still down. I'm going to have to redo that again or do it again. Now my health, I think, is going down now because I'm out of food. Yeah, he's not down anymore. Poor guy. I just keep feeding him up, feeding him a little, and then leaving. Yeah, there is something wrong with the crafting. Like, it bugs out really bad. I don't know what's happening there. Hurt this guy again. Is he gone? So where'd my buddy go? I thought we had a really good abusive relationship going on. He's not even here anymore. What happened? Do I have to, uh, what about the other guy? There was two here. Oh, there's another blue chest. So I don't know where he went or either one of them. They're both gone, which isn't great for me. Oh, there's a bed in here. Can't use it nothing to search well that's unfortunate I went through all that trouble and these guys just uh, up and disappeared on me well okay I guess uh, I guess I'll just go back to my tasks and uh, wait for them to respawn I don't know where they went that's too bad I have these berries and they're gonna go bad oh well okay um, a wood barrier and a wood gate go into here did i go up another level i'll have a look here i don't think i did i am starting to get a little full here i should probably make a satchel you go to queue something up and then it just disappears if you click on something or it doesn't complete all right we'll make three more of those it's like I'm afraid to move if I'm crafting. This should finish the next task. Oh, I made the wrong thing. Okay, so I need eight more rope. Oh, here we go. So way out of the way there. So can't. All right, let's try that fishing trap. Oh, there we go. Haha. Great. I don't know. 
So I guess I just wait. All right, something to come back to. So I need to make a wooden barrier, which is this one here. I made the wrong thing. I made a spike wall. We'll just put it craft the shock absorb module. I think that's done at the crafting bench. No, I can make one right here. And I may as well install it into my feet, into my shoes. I want to get to level 16 here and see what kind of vehicle I can uh, start off with. Placed on shoes. Oh, I see. Okay, double click the shoes. There we go. Cool. I didn't know you can do that. That's great. All right. And craft simple bandages. I think we have that. We need tape and more rope. Always a rope. All right. And uh, craft the stone shovel. Pretty sure we have that. We need two stone and three rope. So we'll start the rope and then I'll go around out and get some stone. Yes. Level 16. Uh, collect crude oil. I don't know how to do that. I must have to dig that. Oh, I wonder if the shovel is for those mounds. Yeah. Okay, let's go try that. Where's my shovel? That's a that's a pretty crude shovel. That's for sure. Okay, let's uh let's try digging here. I am I'm getting crude oil. I can see it. Nice. So this is how I get fuel to begin with anyway. And uh, now that I can make vehicles or do something with vehicles, there we go. Craft a simple fish basket, which I've already done. Cook grilled fish. Let's see if we got any fish in the basket. Oh yeah, we do. We have one trout, we have three trout. Okay, I'm gonna run out of inventory space. How many do I have to cook? I have to cook 10, so I gotta wait a little while. I may as well uh, run this over to the fire. I can probably build a fire here too and cook it, but cool. Progress. I'm just going to look at something here real quick. Look at all the benches I can make now. Fire this up. So it takes two fish to make one fish. Okay. That sounds fair. All right, let's look at this simple pouch because I am running out of room uh, we have weapons I wonder if I use that sickle instead of my hands to gather uh, fiber and stuff I get more berries yeah now I'm curious maybe I can get more berries if I use that sickle because I think the sickle what does it say here sickle made of stone effective for harvesting plants so we'll make this while well, that's cooking away I'll pull my wood out of here I'm guessing that goes right there have a look at my tech tree here vehicle factory I can make a vehicle factory yeah I'll give you ether shirts at least now there's a cost for skills that's cool I just thought it was a little easy but this is great. Look at all the vehicles, all the stuff you can do for vehicles. This is going to get really interesting. Uh, what else can we unlock here? W wooden table. Sh oh, now, now we have a cost. Okay, so I don't, I don't need a wood table. Let's not worry about a wood table. Uh, weapons are always welcome, though. I don't see any there that I can unlock. Gear is really important. Nothing to unlock. And what do we have here? Beast trap. Yeah. Oh, another trap. These are all traps, right? Okay. We will, uh, we'll just have to wait. A pouch. Unlocks one inventory slot. Can be placed on top wear and pants. That's crazy. One slot. That sucks. That's not a good return. What kind of satchel is that? Whatever. Okay. Well, I got that done at least. All right. Yeah, I think that's going to be uh, it until I can get this NPC uh, trained. What do I think? I think it's uh, it's a little buggy for sure. Um, graphics are, you know, sometimes are really great. Uh, it plays well. The combat's not too bad. Melee combat's a little weird. It's hard to judge distance. 
uh the bow and arrow works quite well so far yeah i like it I, I might make a video series on this i mean it's something new right there's so much of the island i i haven't even explored yet there's so much it's huge this thing is massive it's like a multiplayer game and i'm playing it solo so it should keep me busy for a long time oh look at that grilled fish stamina boost that's really cool yeah there's so much there's a lot to this game that i don't know about i have to figure out how talents work i'm gonna go look that up talent book nine i'm not sure what that means oh research i think i can make a research bench right I saw something about research pop up i'm just gonna have a real quick look here and then i'm gonna i'm gonna get out of here i think what do we have here? Weapon, grinding, gear, medical, metal, and vehicle. I swear I, I saw something, something to do with research. Ah, maybe I'm wrong. There's so much to build now. I got so much to do. There's enough here to keep me busy for quite a while. Yeah, I think I'm going to, I'll, I'll do another video on this. I'll, I'll play a little more. We'll see how this one turns out. See if you guys want to see any more or not. But I'm definitely, uh, I'm curious. Absolutely curious. There's a lot to do.